Hello? Okay, this is on. Hello, yes. Alright, I'm gonna test out this, uh, C. Drake animation, which has been giving me a lot of trouble. Um, so every time I had to make it this C. Drake two separate scripts. One that it like kind of charges up and then it spits fire because if I just did it like one attack script it would start spitting fire while it was uh, right there that wind up so it just spits fire the entire time see so it goes it inhales and then it spits out so that's two separate scripts Boosh. See? Whoosh. This is actually a pretty difficult enemy. You see there's like a split second of jank. And I made sure that there are the exact number of frames divided by 8. And uh, I feel like no matter what I do, it doesn't do it on the right side. And it's a, it's a script thing because I slowed down the frames just to see, like, uh, when I was testing it, what what could possibly be going on. And what's happening is it's searching for the uh, sprite. It's searching for the Danny sprite, the Danny object, I should say, to, um, to face in that direction. Sometimes it does it, sometimes it doesn't do it. Um, I think I'm just going to let it be like this for now until it's time to optimize everything again. As you can see, I still have to add ears onto the animation, but I, I kind of just wanted to test out this two, um, this two script combo thing. Um, yeah, I don't, I can't even get hurt right now because I've been testing this for hours and trying to get it just right. And, um, this enemy is actually pretty difficult. Okay, okay. And of course, I got my janky keyboard today. Oh, man. So, my next step is like, a. The fire, like you'll be able to hit the fire to like, you know, make it go away. So there it is. I got the sea drake. I think it turned out pretty good. Usually I get really excited when I first make the uh, initial like spray. And then uh, the uh, walking animation or whatever, floating animation, I guess you could say for the for this one. And then it's like, oh, I'm so excited. I can't wait to um, add uh, the attacks. And then once I start doing the attacks in eight directions, that's when I just start losing momentum. And then after that... Um, just kind of a, there's always some complications with the code, or the animation frames or something. So basically by the time I'm done making any of these enemies, it's just like I'm, I'm completely over it. I just like want to, just want to create the next one already. But here it is, the uh, C Drake. Yay. Just blowing fire on me here. After I add the ears, or the fins, or whatever you want to call it, um, it's time to make the giant clam. And then optimize the, uh, oh, I forgot. I got to make that death animation. 
I gotta make a spawn animation. Ugh, it never ends. But, you know, this is a, it's a lot of fun. So that'll be the giant clam, and I have like a, a jellyfish also to do. Um, so. Seven enemies for one level. Um, how I came to that conclusion of seven enemies, um, if you play Final Fantasy 1, uh, when you get to um, Garland to save the princess, just in the beginning of the game, there are seven enemies. And um, so I always, so I'm thinking there needs to at least be seven enemies per chapter or whatever. Because in Final Fantasy, that would be like a chapter one. You know, you have your goblin, your goblin chief, the the crazy horse, um, a zombie, I, I think also a skeleton. I, I could be wrong. Uh, that purple worm looking thing. And uh, there's one more. Uh, I don't know what I can't remember what it is. I don't think it's a bat or something. Maybe I'm thinking bat because there were bat sprites. But yeah, seven enemies per chapter. That's my goal, and uh, I'm I'm almost there. Almost there. Just got. I have the uh, jellyfish um, done. I just have to animate the rest of the directions for the attack and i'm glad i had to test this out because her attack is going to have to be two scripts it's actually going to have to be three scripts she winds up she charges forward and then so she the wind up would be one script charge forward for the second script and then she um kind of does like a slow down type recoil thing so that'd be three scripts and uh, just every enemy I've been uh, doing, it's been uh, more and more getting, gaining more experience for the enemy AI and everything. And uh, so it's been, it's been a journey and so far it's been fun. So that's been this episode of uh, animation, enemy animations. Uh, see you on the next one.